comes to putting together your holiday toy list, you got to have at least a little bit of strategy here. So Joy Fortman is back with Jen with all the toy insider tips that we all need to know. Yeah, we're at Nest in Center City. And by the way, Joey dated a boy Joey. I did. Yeah, but it's cool. Joey all right, so give Joey. us the tips. Joey and Joey. We talked about this at 7 o'clock, but it bears repeating. Mm -hmm. A lot of people think toys go on sale Black Friday. You say, get them now. If your kid has one toy, I always have that like hero gift that Santa brings. Santa is a very busy man. Yeah. So moms, get it and help him out a little bit. So the hero gift. And then um, if you, once you get that, you're, you can always return it. So what you're saying is if your kid wants one thing and it's like a $100 thing and you're worried about whether or not it's going to go on sale, the toy books are already out. Things are already right. on sale. Buy it now just as a backup. Yeah, you, you see the hot toy, toy list everywhere. What you do is you buy what's on those lists. That way you don't have to worry about it. Plus, um, some of them, they're actually going to go on sale later. And the ones that go on sale later aren't always the best toys. The hottest toys in the toy industry go on sale at the very beginning, and then they sell because out. Because that's how they trick them in, us into getting into the stores. Yep. Okay, and then the other thing that you have is you say you should have a plan. You shouldn't just be, like, winging it. No, never wing it, because there's nothing good with that. Okay, <laughs> so the, the trends this year is what's old is new. And Mike Jarek, I've never seen this thing, but really? Joey is from the Midwest, and she says a lot of people, what is that thing? <laughs> this is Puppy Surprise. Okay. It's like retro and robots is really the big trend. And okay. Puppy Surprise, how many puppies does she have? And you have to guess? You guess how and many puppies. each box has a different number of puppies. So how many puppies did we get out of here? I guess we got, got one, two, four. three, four. Oh, okay. we got a little boy in there. Oh, Whee! Oh my goodness. La, la, la. I never had this. Yeah. All right, so that's puppy surprise. Right. And so that's an old thing. Mm -hmm. And then you also say it's all about the robotics. Robotics. Hexbug is one of my favorite of the robotics. And like STEM, the research, the research that the kids are doing Science, right now. Science, technology, engineering, and math. Yes, the four things I wasn't good at. <laughs> um, but they have a bug now that you put this together. It only takes 30 minutes. That's what they tell me. I wasn't able to put this one together because it takes me forever when you got kids. <laughs> okay. but it's a robot. That that's really cool. With. Yep. All right, and then I like this thingy. What is this? This is Mip. This is a cool robot that's out. Okay. Now, you got to get him. Mip is a very great personality. My house, I like him because I always ask my kids to go get me something to drink. Yes. So, let's get him to stand up. Okay, stop. Okay, come back here, Mip. Stop. Oh, good. All right. Now, bring me my drink. Ta-da! Mip, bring me a drink. Bring Mommy her vodka. <laughs> bring me the drink, Mippy. Wow. Um, is this uh, easier than Zoomer? It feels like it's easier than Zoomer. You know, Zoomer has a different personality, obviously, because Zoomer's a dog, and you've got to train a dog. But this robot does the good things. It gives what you want. Yeah. So if you want it, go see. Wow. Oh, oh. Come back to All right. So, and again, a lot of this information is going to be on myfoxphilly.com. Um, Mike, Bob, Alex, <laughs> just so we're clear, every oh. little girl that walks in here, come on, Freaky. one more time. Oh, Ready? Here no. we go. Here we go. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah?